good morning. It's not morning, but it's not that late either. So we got in from St. Louis last night, seeing the grandkids, which was wonderful. And we had a wonderful time and a wonderful trip back up here. Uh, I had a vet appointment at 3.30. All my checking on Dion while we were gone, he was barely eating. It is very cold and windy here today. Well, my girlfriend said it was 12 degrees at her house. It's, it was 35, it's 43, it just feels very cold. The wind's blowing out of the north. Probably straight from Nebraska, where my friend lives, where it's 12 degrees. <laughs> it feels very cold to me. So we, um, got in and I found Dion outside and he was, I mean, he lifted his head and looked at me, but I knew he was dying. I know, I've known all week he's been dying, all week. But last week was so sunny and warm, it was 58 degrees at night, so... He does come in. He comes in anytime he wants, but since he's been sick, he hasn't really wanted to always be inside. Sometimes I'd have to make him come in at night. So anyway, I knew last night that was it. And uh, this morning my help found him. And so she comes rushing to the house and I said, he's dead. She said, yes, he's dead. So I had said my goodbyes last night, cried my tears last night, and the truth is, is uh, he, you know, there's nothing you're going to do for them when it's time. Just be wonderfully happy that you got to spend time with them and that you will get to spend eternity with them. This isn't the end. You know, I think the reason that death is so hard is because we were never created to die. Our bodies were not even created to die. Of course, our soul and our spirit never dies, but our bodies were not created to die. And when they do, or we get sick and we suffer, it's not, that's not God's normal. Things like that don't happen in heaven. There is no death. There is no decay. There is no rot. That's why there's not going to be, there's only going to be Holy Spirit wine in heaven. There's not going to be alcohol like you know it now because it ferments and there's nothing that rots in heaven. So I have heard that there are, pubs in heaven that you just drink the Holy Spirit. You, you can get drunk and fall on the floor and roll around and laugh too if you want to. Anyway, I, I've kind of been crying over this all last week. So this was not a surprise and I just let him go, right? I, I love you. I let you go. I will see you on the other side what I had to say so anyway I'm very sad to lose my boy uh, when I came home from Houston the, I was there the 18th 19th 20 21 so I got home 22 I got home Monday he had just lost 10 or 15 pounds and he didn't feel good and then I started him on some pain medication and I changed his food a little bit and he still was so Tim said when he went to pick him up this morning that he smelled so bad that, and it was freezing cold last night, so it was 35, so almost freezing cold. So it wasn't that he had been laying, you know, rotting, but he was, something was wrong, I think, in his stomach. Last night I noticed his stomach looked a little distended too, so... Anyway, 10 good years, he was definitely my boy, 
I'm so glad I got that video of him taking a walk. This was a couple months ago, one Sunday evening. We just walked and walked. This was before the time change. So it must have been in October. We'll walk again in heaven forever. So that's my news today. I'm going to bury my boy. He's in the back. I'm going to my dad's where he has a backhoe where I, mar I buried my Desi girl and my as a child I had a dog for 13 years and he's buried in the same place that's where I'm taking that's where I'm taking Dion to be buried so and I'm headed to the vet after that we're going to get Bugsy's heart listened to again and I have two people that think their puppies have Giardia which I don't believe that so my Kairos and my Happy I'm going to have their stool tested I don't know why vets like to say things like this. If a puppy really has Chiardia, you, number one, you have to do two tests to determine that, not just one. And just because your puppy has loose stool doesn't mean he has Giardia. That Giardia is a very serious bacteria to get rid of. Anyway, so if their puppies really have Giardia, they picked it up somewhere else. They didn't get it here. So anyway, I got Happy and Kairos with me today. So I'll do some videos of them. They're such happy puppies. I'm very pleased with my puppies that I kept. So that's all my news. I, Joy was calling me and she like never calls me in the middle of the day or I don't know why she's calling me, but I'm gonna call her back. So pray for you that we would have eyes to see into eternity that God has a wonderful plan that we would all come back home to live with him if the world of heaven is as big as this universe there's room for everyone and all our pets too plenty of room in heaven. Let's just make up our mind we're going to make it. Not of works, but because we choose God to be our Father. We surrender ourselves. So, Father, we just praise you. We love you. We thank you for life. I thank you for the gift of Dion that you gave me for 10 years. sad as it is to say goodbye I know it's not goodbye forever you are my hope you are my promise of eternal life Father I thank you for that and just pray that we would all have eyes to see into eternity and to look forward to meeting those that have gone on before us we praise you and we thank you Lord in your precious holy name Amen